I bought this, a mast and some sails. Here's my idea. Instead of using mast and some sails to power it on the water, I'm going to fit it with a mast and a mast and some sails. How brilliant is the mast and some sails? I have no idea what I can do, which is why I have bought a camper van. Yep, it's a Toyota Hilux pickup truck, which I chose for two reasons. Firstly, as we've proved with a number of tests on Top Gear, it is completely destructible. This is a great little album, because everything's in it. See, what you do, you pop in there, put this down, pop in there, put this down. I might need to be a little bit longer. The... the... look... the... look... I was thinking more, Steve, in terms of this, to be honest. Yes. In fact, I'm thinking more in terms of two of these rather than one of these. Well, how many horsepower is that? Oh. That's half the horsepower of a Formula One car, which will get you along very nicely. 225 horsepower is a small amount of horsepower. Honestly, I want this. But don't you just want it to sort of go? That's 2.3 horsepower. Got it. <laughs> oh, for God's sake! <laughs> right, that's got it. In the traditional spirit of Top Gear comradeship, we left James behind. Jeremy appears to be having what a fancy ride. Not a Finally, I arrived at the reservoir. <laughs> Now, while we're waiting for James, I should explain it's March. It's the coldest March for 20 years because of global warming. And that means the water into which we shall be driving is... Well, how, how would you...? <laughs> the big question was, which would arrive first, James May or James May? Where is it? I, I mean, he's got to show up at some time. Low bridge, you know, mast. Where's he going? Watch this. 